Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's uh, Wednesday the 21st of June 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, I wasn't going to play a game of Sudoku uh, this uh, today. Um, the This was not on my schedule. I actually had work scheduled uh, all the way through the afternoon, right up to the, the evening, and I thought I'm going to be too tired to play a game there. I was doing my first uh, work, sh scheduled work, um, when I got a message to say, could I take on some urgent work, and I refused. I said, no, sorry, I'm busy with scheduled work, so can't accept it. And uh, after I finished my first job, moved on to my second job, uh, and the second job suddenly got cancelled. Uh, people weren't available, and so that was cancelled. So I got back onto the urgent work and said, okay, I'm free now. Can I do it? And they said, sorry, we've given it to somebody else. So <laughs> to quote Jack Lemon in one of my favorite films of all time, The Apartment, that's the way it crumbles cookie-wise. And so uh, what does one do when one's um, uh, um, uh, daily schedule is uh, cancelled? One plays Sudoku. Why not? Nothing else to do. Well, I have. I've got more work to do later on, but I've got a break now, so it gives me a chance to play this game of Sudoku, which I wouldn't otherwise have played today. So I'm going to start with this New York Times special type of thing with the six and eight blocking across. That's what I see first before I see anything else. So I know that the six and the eight are going to be in those squares there. What does it mean? It means sixes are down here. What does it mean for the eights? Nothing. Oh dear. All right, but we've got six and eight there, so at least we know here we are looking for uh, three, seven, nine. And we've got nines blocking like this. Oops, there we go. And we'll have three and seven in those squares there. Uh, three, four, seven, eight. Seven, eight. Uh, right, okay. Right, shall we look for some easy ones before we go any further? Hoping that there are a few easy ones. Okay, five will do. Oh, would help if I hit the right key. One seven and one eight. They're being quite mean today. Okay, we've got nine up to the top, nine across here. So nine in one of those two squares blocking down and then nine across here. Uh, so we have one and six blocking across here like this. And if you remember, our six 
blocked across here. So we had six in those squares. So one and six also blocking down here. So we've got ourselves a pair of one and six down here like this. What does it mean? Well, it certainly means that that's three, but um, and we already know threes are in uh, those squares. So it's not particularly pleasing. Uh, one six. So what else do we know? Twos, three, seven, and eight. What do we know about the seven and the eight? We know the uh, eights block down here, right? We have the eight blocking across here like this. So eights are here. So blocking down here. So then eights will be in those squares there. Is that going to help us? Uh, not much. Well, it may help some people, but it doesn't help me a great deal. Sevens, I don't really know anything about the sevens, do I? Oh dear, seems to be a lot to uh, find today. Should I investigate these squares? I know this is one and six, so we'll be looking for two, three seven, eight. Oh dear, I don't like the way this is shaping up because it's not shaping up yet for me. Uh, I didn't, uh, this was uh, six and eight. I didn't investigate these, did I? So we've got six and eight there. So we're looking for two, three, seven. Any help on two, three, or seven in these squares? Answer, absolutely not. Okay. Got to try though, got to try.
Oh, not a good start. Not doing anything here. Okay, let's put in some pencil marks because I'm getting nowhere. Let's put in the one and the six there. Let's put in the threes there. Let's put in the six and eight in those squares. Let's put in the three and the seven in those squares. Right, and now let's see what else we've got. I know we've got ones up there and we've got ones here. And what else do we know? Twos are up here. There we go, six across here and six up here. We've got ourselves a pair of sixes there, which means that that is a six, in fact. And this is a one. Okay, that should help us a bit. Uh, now let's see what we're missing down here. One, uh, seven, and eight. Um, so we've got eights here. Uh, earlier on, I said eights have to go in those squares as well, didn't I? So we will have eights up there now. And now we have a pair of ones. Oops, sorry. pair of ones in these squares if I can hold down two keys, right. Okay, we've got a pair of threes here, which is going to put three into that square there, which means this is a three and this is a seven. Seven across here and seven down here. We now have a pair of six and seven here, which is nice. And we have a pair of sevens down here. So we know this has to be one and this would be one. And these two squares cannot be one. Uh, one will in fact be down here though. Okay, six and seven. So in the missing squares here, we're looking for two, th two, three, and five. So threes must appear in those squares, which means that that won't be a three. That will be a three, and this will be an eight. And our missing numbers here are four and nine. Oh, looks like we've got the only place for a four up here now. So there's our four. This will be a four. This would be a nine. Uh, and now we have a pair of nines there, which means that the missing number over here is going to be seven. Uh, that's going to give us a pair of sevens down there. So that means sevens must be in those squares as well. We also have a pair of sevens up here like this. Now, what's uh, missing from these squares here? It looks to be a, looks to be a two, I think. So we've got the two blocking down here. So... This is our two, this is our eight, and that means this must be a two up here, and the missing number here is going to be uh, an eight. That's going to give us a pair of eights over there, but we've got the six blocking up here, so we, oh, six blocking there, that's our six, excuse me. Let's get rid of that, and this will be seven. And the missing numbers here are eight and uh, four, I think, four, eight, there we go. Right, uh, what else do we need to do? Shall we start again? We don't have any completed digits yet, so let's just carry on. Oh, what was this? Two and five, so twos 
are in those squares and fives are in those squares. There we go. Right, ones, twos. Three, uh, four blocking across here and four down here. And this is seven and eight anyway, so four must be in that square. That's going to give us four somewhere across the middle here. Uh, the two blocks across here, so that's got to be a pair of twos, meaning this must be a three, that must be a two, this must be a five, and five will go in this square here. And we'll have five somewhere along the bottom here like this. Uh, let's see again. All right, I think ones are sorted out. Twos can go in these squares here. Threes, three blocking across here and across here and down here means that that's our three. Threes down here, down here and across here gives us a pair of threes in those squares. Fours, okay, fives. Uh, five across here and across here means that's a pair of four and five now. So this is the only place in this column where a five can go. We know it's a five and we'll get rid of the fives there. Uh, six, okay, seven. Uh, seven down here and across here means that seven is in one of those squares, meaning this is six and this is seven. Six now gives us an eight in that square, six in that square. And the eight across here and across here gives us an eight there, which gives us an eight up there and a four in that square. This is not a four. Um, still haven't got any completed digits. How about that? This is the furthest I think I've ever gone without getting completed digits somewhere. Okay, we have eights as a pair down there. Nines go there. Um, okay, so we've got nine blocking this square here. This has to be a nine for that column. And the missing number in this column is two, is it? I think so. So two goes there. So that's our two, that's our one. That's the one over here. This is a six. That's our six there, and this is not a six. Um, um, I'm, I'm, I'm not, did I finish all of the candidates down here? I'm not sure. I think it's okay. So, yeah, we've got seven definitely in this square here, and uh, two definitely in that square there. And... This should be a three, and that's a seven, and that's a three, and this is an eight with a seven there, and seven in this square, nine there, nine up there, five there, five there, four there, four there, and eight there. That's our game uh, with candidates, with pencil marks for New York Times for Wednesday. Uh, I don't think I'll be back later tonight, but you never know, I might. See you around. Bye-bye.